Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can integrate your VoiceFlow chatbot into WordPress. So uh, yeah, let's dive in. Um, if you're new with VoiceFlow, there's a link in the description. If you use that link, you will get a thousand bonus credits. This is 10 times more than just on the free plan. So yeah, if you're new, use my link. And then once you have signed in, you will see something like this. You are inside your home. Then navigate to projects and or go to your actual chatbot or create a new project. In my case, I'm going to create a new chatbot. So new project and then start from scratch. And then you will get a standard template, which is the agent step. You can skip everything. Um, make sure you publish your chatbot. And then in the meantime, if you go to WordPress, you will have to go to plugins. And install plugins. Add a plugin. And then you'll have to search to WP code. And on this plugin you have to install. Once you have installed your plugin, you will see on the menu on the left side the code snippets. Click over there and then navigate to header and footer. Okay, so in the meantime, our chatbot is published, cool. In VoiceFlow, on the left side, you will see the menu, the workflow, knowledge base, and the interfaces. Click on interfaces and then copy the code snippet. Once you have copied that, you'd have to go to, the, to WordPress again, and then add that code to the footer. So right now, if I go to the, chat, to the website, this is a website. There's no chatbot yet. And then in the footer, you'd have to paste that code. You just copy it inside VoiceFlow and then save changes. And then refresh your website and you will see your chatbot on the, in the bottom right corner, unless you have changed something. Um, but yeah, right now we have integrated our chatbot from VoiceFlow into a WordPress website and yeah, if you want to, you can also, inside the interface, you can um, change your widget, um, you can install here, you can also change the style or appearance, uh, logos, you can do whatever you want to. <coughs> and it is just very straightforward. For example, if we, if we don't want to test your agent in this, this uh, launcher, and you want this one, click on that, and then go back to your workflow and then publish that. You don't have to delete the code and uh, paste it again or save it again inside WordPress. It will automatically change it. So right now we have the test your agent launcher. And after it is published, you will see it is updated. So let's refresh it. And there we go. So this, this is also every time once you have a new update within your chatbot, once you publish it, it will be automatically um, like updated in the existing widget. So yeah, this is how you can integrate your VoiceFlow chatbot with WordPress. If you have any questions, just drop it in the comments. Thank you for watching. Bye.